what's going on guys jake the happy snake here and welcome back to jake wants to be a millionaire i hope everybody had an awesome weekend on friday i won a thousand dollars for the fifth game in a row yeah every day last week i won a thousand dollars i don't know it was just absolutely pathetic all i won last week was five thousand dollars in total like that's, that's so stupid so Four out of the five games last week, the question I got wrong was the eighth question. Yeah. So, on Friday, I got the $8,000 question wrong. I... So, what I did was I switched the question, okay? I I thought maybe I knew the answer, but I really wasn't sure, so I switched, switched the question just to be safe. It turns out that I, I would have been right, so that sucked. I got a new question that was also valued at $8,000. I had no idea what the answer was, okay? So, I phoned a friend. I called Nadia's aunt because... Two of Nadia's phone friends have proven, proven to be horrible already. And Nadia's aunt gave me an answer that I... I mean, the answer that she gave me, I was originally thinking. And it was wrong! Yeah! So... <laughs> so another $1,000 that brought my overall total to $22,182,364. So, it's a new week. I'm gonna have to try to forget about last week. Uh, let's just... Let's let's have a good game to start this this week, Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna try to go into a new tradition of playing as a different character each week. I played as Nadia last week. Uh, I'm, I'm actually okay with this because her phone friends were just pathetic, okay? And I didn't even get a chance to call the, the other phone friend. I only called three last week, and I, I'm glad I, I didn't phone the fourth because I have no idea what they would have done. So, yeah, nothing against the character, just her phone friends were horrible. Uh, so for this week, I'm going to play as Massimo. I've won the million dollars with him before. I'm hoping that's going to bring me good luck. So yeah. Let's do this. Okay, first question for $100. What is the last name of the author of Fables whose first name is Asat? It is unknown. C. Okay. That's $100. For 200, what do you call the horizontal lines in which music is written? A staff. Okay, $200. For 300, which animal is known as the king of beasts? The lion. Which is also the name of the Montreal, the Montreal Canadiens ECHL team. The lions. Okay, $300 for 500. Which of these is not a percussion instrument? A piece. Final answer. That's five hundred dollars. And now for one thousand. How many books make up the Hunger Games series? Oh come on! I'm gonna go with three. Yes. Okay. Woo! go one thousand dollars all right come on Whew. this is for two thousand what kind of vehicle is used in bmx an off-road bicycle final answer i think i own a bmx game or at least i did it's two thousand bucks so for four thousand now what describes the hatter in Alice in Wonderland, mad. Final answer. Always late. No, that would be that would be Rachel Wilson from Heroes of Vivia. Okay, four thousand bucks. The next question is the is the question that got me four times last week. Okay, the eight thousand dollar question. Which of these is an irregular verb in English? To do. So good that I'm taking an English course. Okay, all right, that's good. 8,000 bucks. This is for 16,000. What is another name for a fennec? I really want to say prairie dog. The other three answers don't even... They don't even... Okay, you know what? This is going to 
Okay, Desert Fox. Alpine Lobster. Oh, man. <laughs> okay, Alpine Lobster really didn't ring any bell at all. All right, I'm glad I did that. That was a good move. Okay, good. We got 16,000 bucks. Guys, oh my gosh. One question away from not winning $1,000. Okay, 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 okay. What is a gorilla's diet? I want to say herbivorous, but I'm, I'm, yeah. Should I switch? I'm just going to switch. Let's just, is it herbivorous? I got to start trusting my own gut. <laughs> okay, you know what? What is a baby? What is the baby of a deer and a stag called? A fawn. Oh man! Okay, I really wasn't sure about that, but I just did not feel like using another lifeline. Okay, that's good. Thirty-two thousand dollars. I was more sure on the question that I switched out of. That's great, guys. I'm not gonna win a thousand dollars today. I hope this is a sign of a of a good week. Okay, two lifelines left. The most useless lifelines in the game, so that's good. This is for $64,000. What's a storyboard? Ooh. A fairy tale book, a sketch of a movie scene, a piece of film, cutscenes. I want to say a fairy tale book, but I also am not really com comfortable with going with that. So I'm going to ask the audience. They're going to be useless, which might actually help. If A is like the third highest percentage, I might just go with it. Um, so I know it's not B. Can I think of it? Actually, might. Yeah, see, I'm. I, I don't know. It might actually be cutscenes. Okay. Uh, let's phone a friend. It'd, it'd be nice to double my money um let's go with edward so they said d d was the third highest right you're not gonna have a lot of time to pick the answer that you think is right it's, meanwhile they're you know wasting time Why did I even bother? Okay, I'm gonna go with my gut and say fairy tale book. I'm not gonna listen to him. Final answer. What? Wow. I actually am surprised that the audience was right. Holy crap. A sketch of a movie scene. Storyboard. Okay, well, uh, all right, now I know that. Dang. Holy mackerel. That's surprising. I'm surprised that the audience was actually right on the 11th question of the game. That's, uh, that's definitely a shock. All right, so I didn't lose anything today, which is awesome. $32,000, that brings my overall total to $22,214,364. So guys, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. A good start to the week. I will see you all back here tomorrow. Hopefully I can win more than $32,000. Guys, I will see you then. Peace out.